Welcome, Kleshka crew. It is time for vlog hey. number. Hey. Hey, hey, you filming a uh, vlog 200? Uh, yeah, guy that's dressed exactly like me and looks exactly like me. I'm trying to film the intro right now. Awesome, dude. I can't wait to see it. It's going to be great. Okay, cool. Uh, thank you. Uh, have a good day. I'm going to continue with the video. Let's go, guys. Number 200. Javi, on me, Javi, 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 on me, on me, on me. Hey kid, you wanna play catch? Okay. Alright, you ready? Yeah. Alright, here you go. Great though, Dad. My dad is my favorite. We do everything together. We play catch, we go to games, he lets me play Fortnite on weekdays, he bought me this dog, and um, yeah, I love him. Honestly, I'm surprised everyone hasn't caught on yet. Of course he's my son. We look exactly alike. He's my own flesh and blood. I love the kid. We have so many great memories. Oh my god, and... you knew so terrible. I'll be right back. Give me a minute. Ryan, I told you, no more Fortnite after dinner. But dad. I don't care. Turn it off. But dad, you don't understand. There's five people left. I don't care. Turn it off. Fine. Anyways, yeah, he's a great kid. I love the kid. The couple in softball? Like, the softball couple? Yes, I would say so. Yeah, a couple. I guess so, yeah. Mm -hmm. <sighs> we have a great relationship. It's just, I don't know, that one pet peeve. He always washes the clothes with A1 sauce. I don't get it. The reason I do it is because I want my clothes to smell A1. But Sierra hates it. Oh great, this guy. Sweater, sweater, sweater. Hey, I told you there's only room for one car guy in the softball crew. What do you mean, dude? It's a Honda. You can't be a car guy. I'm older, so I've been a car guy way longer. And have you seen my car? It's stick shift, it's got VTEC, it's reliable. It's got a soft top. I can put it down, go down PCH, you know. Cruising, bro. He may have me on the looks, the age, the brains, and the car. But, you know what? I love my car. It's, I have a bigger engine than him. It's black. More doors to pick up more ladies. I have a sticker. And I have a Dragon Ball Z shift knob. So, I think I win. Hey, guys. Want to hear a joke about construction? Nah, I'm still working on it. <laughs> I was so stoked to come home today. I had this great joke to tell everyone when I got in, so I was like super hyped. Um, and I, I think I'm the funniest one in the group. I, I think there's no, no question about it. I'm definitely the funniest one. Whenever I see Ronnie, it just brightens my day. He always makes me laugh. Dude, it's like, honestly, like, you know, we argue about our cars, but when I just see Ronnie do... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ronnie's just not funny. He's been saying literally the same joke for approximately like three months or so. It just gets old. He always thinks he's funny. You know, a lot of people think Ronnie's funny. You know, I, he's, he's my younger brother. I live with him. I see him every day. I watch him Google his jokes. So I just give him tiny little pity laughs. The, they're not funny. I feel really bad. Poor kid. So I heard Ronnie's being pegged as the funny one in the group. What has he done that is funny? Just exist? Is that all you have to do to be the funniest one in the group? Exist? I've been existing longer than he has. I've made people pee their pants because that was it. I'm that funny. I made people cry because I was that funny. I made people almost have a heart attack because I'm that mean. But going back to the subject, I'm the funny one. Not him. So Benny, I tried to get you french fries, but all they had was hash browns. Oh man, yeah, well fries, hash Sorry. browns. You're, you're forgiven. I really wanted fries, man, but he got me this hash brown, but he's probably junk anyway, so. But yeah, man, I, I've been eating these for a long time, since I was a baby. My grandma started cooking them for me, then my mom, now my wife, and what can I say, man? I just, I'm a, I'm a potato. I love fries. They're hash brown, too. I like you. 
play good music and you have an A on your hat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's my entire life savings. Enjoy it. American music. Yes, Street performing. Uh, I love to do it. Performing in front of a bunch of crowd, you know, a big crowd. Um, I won just out a seven hundred dollar uh, tip, which was awesome. This one American dude, really cool dude, you know. Um, but one time I got chased by this one Russian dude. He's completely nuts. He literally came out of his house and came running out and just startled me. So I start. Don't get your money back. Come on, little boy. Come to Papa. Yes, I do not like American music, especially when it wakes me from dreams about murdering Bobby Crosby. It makes me so... <laughs> hey man, where am I? Why is this camera here? What is this? Why is there a dead guy in my apartment? What is this? <laughs> Are you my dad? Who are you? Was that my dad? That's a dead guy. Great service, Robert. Five stars as always. Yeah, so Fireball moved in here about seven months ago, and uh, doesn't look like he's leaving anytime soon. I can't really kick him out, because, you know, I've known the guy for a long time. He's a pretty good guy. He's a good guest. Um, he stays over in the west wing of the house, kind of far away from, from my wing. Uh, and I rarely hear him except for a night when he gets the night terrors every once in a while. He just wakes up screaming his head off, uh, which I wouldn't mind too much, except for when it wakes up his peacock, and then the peacock just starts... <laughs> It's, it's, it's worse than that, though. It's worse than that. So, um, uh, but, you know, I'll let him stay for ever, I guess. Are you kidding me? This place is absolutely fantastic. Great service, great food, and don't even get me started with the hot tub. I am absolutely never leaving this place. I am so glad I moved out of Shorty's dump. Uh, I'm going to try and hit the old dusty trail. <sighs> Mahogany or sandalwood. What the cowboy choose? Mahogany. Boom, baby. Can't forget my poncho. Found my dinner. Mmm! Root and toot and scrumps delicious. My mom and pa taught me the fine art of playing the banjo when I was just a wee lad. A lot of people think the cowboy life ends at softball. Uh-uh. Every morning I dig for gold, hope I strike it lucky. And every night I hunt varmints with my knife. I didn't choose the cowboy life. Cowboy life chose me. Are you really playing cowboy again? Come inside, there's pizza. Uh, okay, honey. Hey, I heard you saw that good art. Yeah, what you want? You got that pirate alien? Yeah, you know it. It'll be 20. I started doing business with you. Yeah! I've had to start selling in the streets. Ever since I painted the Mona Lisa, museums won't let me put my artwork up anymore. Hey, man, that was an awesome day. It was. Hey, uh, he always has his headphones on, you notice that? Yeah. What does he listen to? Oh well. 
we're gonna say I love my Justin Bieber. Hi right, everybody, thank you for watching Vlog 200 and giving me the opportunity to make 200 vlogs. I love doing it, I'm glad you guys love the videos. Thank you so much to everybody that helped me put this together. I love doing it and I'm glad I could do it. So yeah, thank you everyone. Like the video, subscribe, and I will see you next time for more Clutchka vlogs and just more videos in general.